Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission has announced that it will start registering Kenyans living within the East African community next week. Now, IEBC Chairman Isaac Hassan says that registering Kenyans living outside the region will not be possible owing to logistical nightmares. It is now confirmed that Kenyans living beyond the East African region will not be able to exercise their constitutional right to vote. Isaac Hassan, the chairman of the electoral body, attempted to sugarcoat the announcement that will no doubt generate outrage from those disenfranchised. This first election is very complicated. There is so much to be done. So for the diaspora, we were asking them to please be realistic, let them understand We'll sue you. We'll go to court. House Speaker Kenneth Marende endorsed the decision, saying that it is an acceptable compromise and the centers IEBC will be able to cover will be enough for now. Going out to the United States of America, going out to the UK, Going out to Australia and other jurisdictions like that is fairly complex. And that you are able to begin is like you are taking a first step. And we are prepared to accept that because we know that next time you will extend and cover the whole diaspora. Hassan's statement does not come as a surprise given that cabinet ruled it would be impossible to register Kenyans living abroad. Justice Minister Eugene Wamalwa had also said earlier that a diaspora vote for the coming elections was just too involving logistically. Kenyans outside the country had a say. We always knew we had a say, but this time it's like we have been denied a chance to make that say clear. The IEBC now finds itself in an awkward situation, settling on a position they had earlier said would not occur. The commission uh, is independent. It doesn't take direction from the, from the cabinet or the minister. Kenyans in the diaspora had issued a threat saying they would sue the IEBC for being disenfranchised. Those in the East African states will however be registering to vote soon as plans to have them do so are currently underway.